RT or SLJ's bro can swap over for you. No problem. It's okay. Priorities first as per usual, right? Exactly, that's the reasoning, right? You can always just swap characters. But he's like, no, I'm gonna stay on Horan. Okay. So I'm also gonna judge you the whole way. <laughs> no, no, I won't, I won't, I won't. <laughs> it's all good. I didn't say anything to him when Nate was playing it. You're falling asleep? It's all good, man. So... Next week na lang, Jared. If ever. You know, the funniest moment is that I avoided the, the burning fist of Suma only to get hit, hit by Jules. <laughs> oh, Jules threw it out on you? It do be. Either one of them can have it. Well, again, it's gonna be what do you call that? Since they're all walk-in players, right? I'll put you in uh, the roulette, the wheel. So it's not guaranteed that you're going to be playing uh, for the ninth, the ninth and last set for tonight. He removed it from the G drive. I am. Tara. <laughs> I might get to play it, so uh, warm up ako. <laughs> Were you gonna play? Wait a minute. The ninth set is against Trace. Do you want to play against your teammate, Em? <laughs> That's your teammate. Don't you guys play already? He's like, no, I'll play him on stream. Para different. Ah, true. <laughs> there you go. The mix-ups right now. Making Skirt guess a lot right there, but tired of guessing. 1-1 one, one plus 2 to get out there. 12 frame mid. Very fast option for Hachi Mishima. Ooh, really maximizing the frames there. Wanted to get the hell sweep. Kind of poetic to do it against a Mishima. It was so unexpected. I, yeah, true. Actually, it's kind of an unexpected. But it's also not a surprise for me if they throw it out. Because if they pressed it, they pressed it for a reason. Or well, long. They just wanted to check you if your reactions were on point. Right? There's a surge of Hoang players. There's, if you, if I remove what do you call that, the number of times I played Hoang and Cheese Dojang, there's Chi, Hoang would still be part of the top three characters used in the Dojang. And technically, even in Dojang exhibitions, these numbers high, right? For him. And that's not even including me. Day. And no Saiyan as well. Because you don't have the Saiyan outfits on... You're not gonna channel your your, your key energy, right? On Horang. No, it's only on Lars. Heartbroken is RT. Hey, you wanna see the cheese database? I can tell you right now. I can load it up. If we remove all your games, but like... Literally gonna sink. Well, it's not gonna be. She's Julia's not gonna be bottom five, but it's gonna be part of like bottom twenty, which is not bad still, in terms of usage. There are some characters, naman, in Dojang exhibitions that have not shown up yet. Unlike Cheese Dojang, all the characters got played. Nah, Dojang exhibitions not there yet. I could make a post on that. Yeah, I could. I did. What was the last? What was the last trivia before this stream? Uh, it was characters used, right? So I could make one that says characters not used. We need to move the goods <laughs> for Tekken Eight. Yeah, it's got to be part of the base roster. Yeah, she might be. You never know. Hey, but think about it this way, right? If she's part of the base roster, there's no DLC buff for you because all the DLC characters strong, right? Just saying. <laughs> So, uh, you might want them to be DLC. But you have a secondary that you can use in the meantime while waiting for your main to drop in as DLC, right? Not unless, well, I can, uh, you know, if you have no other character in your group, right? Whether you like main, main rotation or secondary, then yeah, you probably want them to be part of the main, the base roster. Because while I can play another character aside from Horang, I wouldn't want to play another character aside from Horang. <laughs> like to get good at the game, no. Ah, uh, low parry still alive. However, the side wall is right there. Whoa, tsunami kicks 15, no punish there, and skirt. Potentially, you uh, know, taking full advantage of that pun that lack of a punish. I, I I'm fine. I just want to, I just want Julia in the main roster now, God. True. I think you can play Nagad, deba. Right? Fair. Down 3-4, starting up these strings. Skirt holding back. Patient. Oh, avoiding the running three there. Fantastic stuff. Looking for the hunting hawk, trying to show Horang up. Look at that. Look at my hunting hawk. Plus one. 
Orang's hunting Hocus Plus One, the first part of it is just that you can't use the plus one ever because they recover in time to what they call that press. Like if you jab trade, you'll jab trade if you press right after. The plus one does not stay there. Uh -huh. 30 seconds left on the clock. Oh! What a whiff punish. The electricity in the air paid the Morocco bill is skirt. Not launch punishing it, but mixing it up around for two slices of red cheese here from the cheese buffet. Ready to break some walls, and it's been two games, right? Time to close the pawl. Oh, I never... I never activated the pawl, my bad. So the pawl's up now. Okay, I missed that out. I did not, did not put it up, okay. Well, you can drop your audience predictions now. It's been two games, so only after this game, I'll close it immediately. And the onslaught does not end here for Rai. Unfortunately, back turn. And the trade works out in Edu's favor. Round two. The pin comment's also updated, right? I'm just double checking with all the stuff I've done. No, it's not updated. Update, update. I think I can remove the serve, serve players. They're not here out there. I can remove that. And then change this to from Eternal to walk-in player. And then cut and paste Magnus, kill, skirt, and Rai. Two set matches. So there's two more sets to go after this. Again, paging, midster, and Foogie Poogie. Please let your presence known in chat. Just drop a cheese emoji or whatever. That way I know you're here. Because you just have to stand by for your set. As it is next after this. Give it around 10 or 15 more minutes and it should be, it should be done. Mm -hmm. Oh, negative 14. No punish there from Skirt. Can anyone play with me for one? I'm SLJ looking for some... Uh, not SLJ. SLJ number two. Again, it's not guaranteed that you'll be the walk-in player for tonight. Fight. If we're still gonna put it through, what do you call this? We're gonna put it through a roulette who will get to play against Trace for the ninth set of the 33rd edition of Dojang Exhibition. Alright, Midster's here. How about Poogie Poogie? Uh, you can also let me know in Discord if you're here. Like, I'm checking the Cheese HQ as well. So you can just put it in check-in or dojang reservations if you're what you call that here. Say sabi ni Sonata, you'll be playing, diba? <laughs> final round. Fight. And we're going to a final round. Looks like the fall pick has worked out in Skirt's favor. Yeah, the back three, while it is increased range, is still not a full consistent punish against Paul's death fist and the demo man. DF2, alright, BNB on deck right now for the warrior against the god of destruction. Cross up, chop, connecting. Really walking with that death fist non stop, all day, every day. Trying to maximize the plus frames with Rai with the sidestep. As rage. Gotta play it a little bit safe. Plus frames on the F3. Ooh, ducks there. And the Rage Drive just whips plus 5 there into DF1-3. Well, Fugi Boogie's not here, then another... Oh, it's Optimus Prime coming in here in the 33rd edition of Dojang Exhibitions. Making his presence felt with this combo. Round start. We'll get the wall as well. Skirt's gonna have to endure all this damage right now. But has Rage, can potentially make something happen here. Or, or not. Let's just adjust it. Again, shift gears, move on to the next round. Fight. Again, Miguel. Page Fugi Poogie. And also paging Fugi Poogie. Where are you? It is almost but well, it's it's getting closer and closer to your time. Or else Midster is gonna play against a walk-in player and it's like what? One, two, three, four, five, six walk-in players. We're gonna go into a roulette. You have an IGN, but you call me SLJ number two. I say I don't know your IGN, bro. You, what do you expect me to do if I don't know your IGN? <laughs> you never played in Cheese Dojang or Dojang Exhibition, so I don't know your IGN. We're not friends on Steam, so I don't know your IG, your other IGN. <laughs> like, bro, there's so much I can do, man. <laughs> With the data I, I have, the information gatherings that I have, okay. 
I'm chatting with him. He probably fell asleep. Okay. If he's asleep, then it's all good. It's just gonna go to a walk-in player then. Ah, good morning. You're right. It is morning. But it's also evening. It's 12 midnight is classified as evening, right? Oh, what a block there in the down back one. Skirt's still alive. However, lost his rage already. And Rai. SLJ Jr. Oh, no. Agent Pato for on-stream matches. Uh, Agent Pato, what do you say? Fight. We play with guys like this all the time. Uh, I play with a wide of array of players from different skill levels, high to low. So, technically, yes. But yeah, these guys play with each other all the time. Perfect. In Dojang exhibitions. This is the kind of level. Well, I mean, well, this is this the average level? I don't think so. If the average level was this, it's pretty high, but it's not. This is not the average level. Wait, I find my IGN. Okay, find your IGN. Let's go. Room, room, skirt, skirt. <laughs> Again, I can't. Oh, yeah, yeah, Jeremy, you can add add uh, Gemini on Steam. I can't add them. No. He's like, no, you add me. Oh, I'm Ben. <laughs> well, the number one thing here, Naman Skirt, for you is that fight. It's keeping you neutral. Number one, keeping you neutral, and then labbing out certain characters. So I mean, this set just opens up that kind of stuff. It's just like, ah, okay, I have to work on this, work on that, stuff like that. And then maybe next time around, if I, if you're, if you play in Dojang exhibitions. And this is also your first time playing, right? So I didn't know your skill level. Because Dojang exhibitions is about making it similar skill level. So the next time you play, you're not going to get Rai. Or players at Rai's skill level, nope. It's going to be someone else. Uh, it depends on who lines up, of course, right? I don't know, I, I, it's out of my control. So I tried to make it as close as possible. I mean, Rai didn't use Lars or Noctis, so... Technically, that's already making it as close as he can make it to you. Mm -hmm. But it has a chance here. Fantastic whiff punish on the Paul QCF1. The elbow. Negative 10, however, probably doesn't know that. Yeah, and that's why you use your fastest punisher to check whether something's unsafe or not. In Paul's case, that's gonna be a one-two, and then if you block a load, it's while standing four. Gets the full string. Yeah, you are you are teammates with uh, soya bean curds, so you get full access to that secret sauce. Another debugger. Yeah, waiting patiently now. Probably for that to make the secret sauce work again. Right, taking that five to zero. Again, good games to both players. Good games. A raid! Oh, oh wow! <laughs> A little short there on the whiff punish. 3 2. 